Now the next topic is peaks and stationary or whites and stationary process. In short, WSS process. So a random process X of t is called a WSS process if the mean and autocorrelation are invariant to a shift in time. That means expectation of X of t is a constant that means independent of time and uh, Rx of t1 comma t2 is a function of time gap t2 minus t1 or t1 minus t2. So in order to prove a process is WSS, first we find expectation of X of t that must be a constant and uh, autocorrelation must be a function of t2 minus t1 or t1 minus t2. Then one problem show that x of t equal to 2 cos phi t plus theta where theta is uniform in 0 to pi is WSS. So in order to show WSS process first we find expectation of x of t. Expectation of x of t is expectation of 2 cos phi t plus theta. So you can take 2 outside then expectation of cos phi t plus theta equal to 2 into expectation of cos, we have to find the expectation of the function cos phi t plus theta. So theta is the random variable here and theta is a random variable in the interval 0 to pi. So to find the expectation we find integrate in the interval 0 to 2 pi cos phi t plus theta into 1 by 2 pi d theta. So we can take this 2 pi outside then 2 by 2 pi integral cos phi t plus theta d theta is sin phi t plus theta limit 0 to 2 pi. So this is equal to 1 by pi into sin 2 pi plus phi t minus lower limit sin phi t equal to 1 by pi into sin 360 plus phi t that is sin phi t minus sin phi t. So which is equal to 0. So expectation of x of t is 0 that means a constant a constant. Now the next is we find Rxx of t1 comma t2. So Rxx of t1 comma t2 is expectation of x of t1 into expectation of x of t2. Rxx of t1 comma t2 is equal to expectation of x of t1 into x of t2 equal to expectation of 2 cos phi t plus t phi t1 plus theta into cos phi t2 plus theta 2 cos phi t1 plus theta into 2 cos phi t2 plus theta. So we can take this 2 and 2 to 4 outside then expectation of cos phi t1 plus theta cos phi t2 plus theta is equal to integral 0 to 2 pi cos phi t1 plus theta cos phi t2 plus theta into 1 by 2 pi d theta. So you can take this 2 pi outside then becomes 4 by 2 pi integral 0 to 2 pi cos a cos b is equal to half into cos a plus b phi t1 plus phi t2 plus 2 theta cos a plus b plus cos a minus b cos phi t1 minus phi t2 d theta cos a cos b is half into cos a plus b plus cos a minus b. So you can take this outside then it becomes 1 by pi. Then integral cos phi t1 plus phi t2 plus 2 theta is sin phi t1 plus phi t2 plus 2 theta by 2. 
limit 0 to 2 pi. Then integral cos phi t1 minus phi t2 d theta is cos phi t1 minus phi t2 into theta limit 0 to 2 pi. equal to 1 by pi sin phi t1 plus phi t2 plus 4 pi by 2 minus sin phi t1 plus phi t2 by 2 plus cos phi t1 minus phi t2 into 2 pi equal to 1 by pi into sin 4 pi plus phi t1 plus phi t2 is sin phi t1 plus phi t2 by 2 minus sin phi t1 plus phi t2 by 2 plus 2 pi cos phi t1 cos 5 into t1 minus t2. These two terms cancel each other then it becomes 2 pi by pi cos 5 into t1 minus t2 pi and pi cancel so 2 cos 5 t1 minus t2 it is a function of t1 minus t2 so x of t is wss <coughs>